My name is Brian with Interlift USA, and today we're going to learn how to safely load and unload your Interlift model into and out of your vehicle. Today we're going to simulate loading into the back of a Sprinter van. Uh, when loading cargo, palletized cargo, you'll notice that the, the Interlift is currently on the floor. The Interlift operates as a pallet jack in your warehouse prior to loading it into your vehicle. What makes this unique is the self-lifting mechanism that allows you to get this product into your vehicle with the machine itself. So today what we're going to do is demonstrate how to raise the product up, push it into the vehicle, and then we'll do an unloading as well. So you'll see palletized freight. We're going to raise up with the toggle button, making sure that our pallet gets above the bed of the truck, and then we're going to push the whole mechanism unit into the vehicle. As you'll notice, the support legs on the bottom are going underneath your vehicle. In order to actually load this whole unit into the vehicle, we'll need to pull those support legs out. The way we do that is to drop the forks down at the bed of the vehicle, putting the entire load on the vehicle's bed. As we drop the forks, you'll notice that the chassis starts raising up. Before we get to the underside of the vehicle, we want to make sure that we pull the support legs out, and then we're going to continue to raise the chassis up. When the chassis gets to its full point, raised point, it will stop. You can push the support button underneath the pallet and into the bed of the vehicle. At this point, you're fully supported by the forks. We need to be able to get that load back onto the support leg to, to push the products in. The way we do that is we're going to raise the forks back up. And we'll be able to easily maneuver the inlift into the machine, safely pushing it in. Once we get to this point, we recommend while you are driving to not only strap it down, but we recommend that you drop the forks to fully stabilize your cargo. To do this, uh, to unload, we just reverse the process. We're raise the forks back up. We're going to pull the end lift out. Safely and easily and slowly, we recommend that. We have, a, uh, we, have a, we have a mechanism system on the bottom of these support legs that allows the load to stop the back of the vehicle. When we get to that point, we know you're ready to, to lower the machine down. Before we do that, however, we've got to make sure that um, our, our forks are, are raised up. Sorry, to lower down. We need to be able to pull the support legs back out. We're just reversing this process. Now we can drop the load the chassis down. Once we get below the vehicle's underside, we'll be able to push these support legs back in and continue to lower the chassis down. This will raise the cargo off the vehicle and you can now easily pull it out. And that's our process to load and unload an inlet.